Hi again, everyone. I'm KCTV5 meteorologist Brett Anthony. On such a beautiful day, we decided to take this week's first edition of Experiments Outside, and it is about air pressure and something called Bernoulli's Principle. In other words, Bernoulli said that if airspeed increases, you reduce or decrease the air pressure. So we're going to do a couple of demonstrations to show you how that works. First of all, have you ever been driving in a car and you go by a truck and you feel like your car's being pulled toward that truck, or if the truck goes by you as it increases its speed, it pulls you toward that truck a little bit? That's Bernoulli's principle at work. So here are two empty soda cans. What I'm going to do is I'm going to blow between the cans. Now we would think that if we blow air between the cans that we would spread them apart, right? Well, here's where Bernoulli's principle comes in. Watch what happens. See how they came together? So we created an area of low pressure and the cans came together. Of course, they spread back apart as soon as I stopped blowing and the air went back to static or high pressure. All right, so let's try another experiment that kind of demonstrates why when strong winds blow over your house, your roof doesn't pop off, right? So what we're gonna do is take this empty soda can, we're gonna put it down inside of this empty mug and we're gonna set this next to each other. Now, I'm gonna stand up and I'm gonna blow directly down into the mug and I'm gonna create low pressure down inside the mug. Well, the high pressure inside the can is gonna keep the can, at least the air inside the can, somewhat static, but it's gonna lift this can and it's gonna put it over into that mug. So let's see if we can get this right. It might take a couple of different tries and you can try this at home. So let's, we're, I'm gonna stand about 10 inches above the cup and give it a nice short burst of air down into that cup. <laughs> How about that? First try, it's always a charm. Anyway, that's this edition of uh, KCTV5 Weather Experiments for you. Give this a try at home. You could even dare someone that you could move that can to this mug without touching the can. How about that? And you know how to do it because of air pressure and a little bit of science.